thank you. Good. How was your show? Did you have a first show last night? No, I've done uh, two shows two now, shows. and uh, uh, they've both been lovely. I've, um, I've fluffed large sections of them. Oh, last lovely. night I did a huge piece, and then later on I referred back to it without even realising I hadn't done it. <laughs> and uh, I didn't actually work that out until about 2 o'clock in the morning. I woke up and went, oh, forgot a large chunk of the show. But so we got, we got through it, I don't think the audience noticed. <laughs> Even though some of it just didn't make sense. <laughs> so you probably have to just keep tweaking it if you're not a friend. Yeah, but it's, you know, a show's organic, so that's normal for me anyway. I write a show and it's uh, it develops during the festival. I think that's a good thing. I think it's, uh, to, to, you, you get very bored of a show that you repeat yeah, word for so word every single day. Well, you get the I would, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, anyone who came in every day would as well. <laughs> I write my shows planning for the audience to see everyone. <laughs> <laughs> okay. And so you've been all over the place. Where's your been all over the place. Oh, been to New Zealand. <laughs> been to South Africa. I've been told off. <laughs> <laughs> you've been everywhere. <laughs> I mean, uh, yeah, yeah, I guess so. Um, it's one of the wonderful things about my job is uh, that comedy is a, a currency. I guess you, I guess wherever you want to go. So. And, and may they continue putting comedy clubs everywhere, <laughs> and may people in the world continue being miserable and needing to laugh. <laughs> <laughs> Do you think um, comedy is kind of therapy then? Yeah, I think, I think of my comedy is therapy, <laughs> but for me, and they're helping me develop right, <laughs> that to myself. <laughs> so, just for you, that's great. So, what kind of um, themes do you cover? I think I've now covered everything. I think there's now nothing left in the world for me to talk about. <laughs> and this year's show is about, I had a heart attack last year, so I'm talking about that this year. Um, which largely I think I'd, I'd run out of subjects. Uh, I didn't cover everything, so I needed to do something. So it was either fall over or, or do something more dramatic. I don't think a good ending of the show, so a heart attack is one of them. And this is your 11th show, is that right? Do you know what? I think you're right. Where did you get that from? How do you know? Somewhere. Google. How do you know more, you know more about me than I do? I've done nine solo shows, okay, yeah. and before that there was, uh, yeah, there was a package show, and then there was a two-hander. Okay, so how do you find it solo? Do you prefer it? I absolutely love it. I, lo I love the, the freedom of having my own house, do whatever I like, yeah. and not feeling feeling bound to. Uh, uh, you know, when you do a show, you do a normal show, you're you're fitting with other people's program. Yeah. Um, it's not your audience. You, yeah, know, so you, you have to realise like that. You so want. yes, yeah. and that, now I can. Uh, structure it and plan what I want to say. Yeah. Doesn't mean I'll get it right. The downside is if it goes wrong, then it's definitely you to blame. My fault. <laughs> yeah, you're right. I didn't think about that. I hate doing the solo show. <laughs> so, do you find it um, tiring? You said you're functioning on a few hours sleep a day. Well, um, I. Yeah, I think when you get up here and uh, because you, you wouldn't normally do so many shows in a day, and, uh, and here it's very easy to run around one gig to another, as I was doing yesterday. Um, which, but it, you know, it's lovely to do that. And what I do like is being in one place for a month. Normally, I'm constantly on trains and buses and planes, and uh, oh, absolutely, being able to settle them and know where you're waking up for. Very nice. Okay, so when and where is the I'm at ten o'clock. I'm at the Gilded Balloon, right next to where we are now, um, in a very lovely room, and uh, and it's a show about what happened last year. Two friends up in the room. Well, thank you very much. Comedy! <laughs> <laughs> well, thanks very much for talking to us. Thank you. Cheers.